Latest developments now on the case of a Vermont man accused by family members of killing his millionaire grandfather and possibly his mother. Nathan Carmen appeared in a New Hampshire courtroom today for a hearing on a lawsuit filed against him by his family members. His aunts allege Carmen killed his grandfather and mother who disappeared while in a boat off the coast of Rhode Island in an attempt to collect inheritance money. Eyewitness News anchor Caroline Goggin joins us now live from the newsroom with what Carmen had to say today. Caroline. Well, Carmen represented himself today after firing his attorneys, but he offered very little information. Lawyers for his family hoped he would provide information about weapons he might own, but Carmen declined to comment when asked about a rifle that's been missing since his grandfather was shot to death in 2013. The family's attorney says a police report shows Carmen bought a gun in New Hampshire that was the same type used in his grandfather's death. Also today, when asked about financial documents, Carmen invoked his Fifth Amendment rights. He says he feels that the documents are unrelated to the case, but right now, Carmen's aunts are attempting to deny him access to his inheritance. It's not the money. It's not so much even uh, my freedom as it is my reputation uh, and seeing that I have a future. Now, in a statement, the family says, quote, Nathan is obsessed with money. All the family wants is justice. From day one, the family has pledged that if they receive money as a result of winning this case, it will go to a charity in Linda Carmen's honor. Nathan wants blood money. The family wants no part of it. Now, Carmen has not been charged in either his grandfather nor his mother's death. In court today, he said he believes his aunts would have had more motive to kill his grandfather than he did. I'm Caroline Goggin, Eyewitness News.